it's so we're gonna we're gonna um what's a what's a good way we're gonna gordian knot cut this business we're gonna cut this gordian knot you give those to the big king what what sorry sorry don't starve don't starve oh 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 Oh. All right. So we're going to go to the overworld map. And we're going to go to the little corner southeast of the highlighted Forgotten Ruin Parasang. I mean, you can you can try to get in that Parasang. Go for it if you want. I go in. You can try and go into that marked one, yeah. But it'll probably tell you too difficult. So now we're going to enter this pair of thing and we're going to go northwest. Hello, everyone. Do -do 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 -do. I got a Kirby song stuck in my head. This is a classic mash the period. Oh, well, actually, they're kind of taking you out a little bit. They're doing some damage. You might want to prioritize the leeches because the uh, tortoise is like definitely the hardest thing to kill there. Everything else is super squishy and the tortoises have like actual armor. I'm going to leave it up to that man. Leave it up to that man. He's He knows what to do. And we can go like right up to that corner. Yep. So we can go north. And now we're in the northwest corner. So we have to actually travel all the way across this entire tile to the other opposing corner. <laughs> More baboons. Those funny monkeys and their croissants. Oh, come on, guys. Come they are, on. Come they are on. actually throwing quiss uh, rocks at you and not croissants. They start with a croissant and then they move on to rocks. What are what are those little... Are those just buns? Hard to say. Are they like ciabatta yeah. buns? Anything, yeah. I, I love a good ciabatta bun. What about you? Pretty good. I'm pretty pro bread in general pro bread i, I have, love a good loaf i appreciate um and and i hesitate saying this because it's the only thing i like on their menu but uh I, I appreciate tim horton's uh crispy chicken sandwich with a shibata bun all right so we want to go north here okay we are technically in hold the mountains on, hold on wait wait what wait wait oh yeah nice good spot you did it. Thumbs up. All right. Now what? All right, now we're just going to head north. And we basically have to do to this um, parasang that you have been doing um, to the rest is we got to find the Forgotten Ruins. So yeah, head north. Eh, well, I don't know if these are the I Forgotten Ruins. Alamu Superior. Do not know if these are the forgotten ruins. I'm, pr they might be, but we're gonna have to sc scan the rest of the parasang to be sure. I think. But first, hungry, hungry. You throw in some spicy ranch, and some crispy chicken, and a ciabatta bun, and make something tolerable. Hmm. Hmm. I'm. F I don't know if we want to make. I guess you can do whatever you want. Do do whatever you want. What? What'd you have in mind? Um. I mean, I was gonna say we don't as. Nah. It doesn't matter because all of these ingredients are gonna become abundant later. So it's it, we don't really have to save anything. That's not a bad one. That's a, that seems like a pretty good combo. 
Heck yeah. I gather what I can find in me a dram of cider, some spine fruit jam, and some dust. Kind of dust. Love that dust. Some. Some. <laughs> Quickness. That's quite good, and quills. Actually. Ooh. Oh, uh, that's a pain in the butt, actually, because quills will replace your, um, your, your, your main armor. Oh. So, like, you, you, it'll unequip your, uh, whatever armor you were wearing and instead, you know, have its own armor. But then as soon as the effects of that meal wear off, you, you'll not be wearing anything and you won't have the AV. What a bummer. But it is Quills at level 6, so it's it's going to offer some protection. Let's have a quick look. Let's look at your E, or uh, your equipment, sorry. So it's at AV4. I'm pretty sure that is better than whatever you were using. Mm -hmm. Quills are quite I nice. I don't remember. Did it destroy whatever I had before? No, it just... didn't. It just unequipped it. Uh, It'll be in your armor. look. Yeah. Oh, okay. So it's exactly the same, except you gain four DV back because the quills don't have any negative to DV. Well, I hope quills always stay then. Quills are quite nice. I like quills. What was that guy? Was he bad? He was bad. Oh. That is Did a gersh. I'm going to shoot him. Nope. He's too close now. Oh, a glow white. You got quite a lot of XP from that. Well, good. There's another one. Oh. Good shooting, Tex. Oh, we have books. Oh. Books. Is and... that guy also bad? No, that's a mysterious stranger. They're fine. They'll occasion like, you know, there's exceptions to when they will not be okay. You definitely want those. Uh, we also have uh, strange tubes. Who has strange tubes? You see those uh, chairs? Oh, those are chairs. Yeah. Oh, shoot. That's a legendary. It's really hard to tell. Wait, wait, wait. Before you shoot him, let's look at their reputation. Loved bears. by poor whites, disliked by bears. Uh, I don't know. I, I made friends with glow whites once in uh, playing cud, and I don't think it really did much for me. But this guy is tough, so he, he might actually do some damage to you. Um, up to you. you like, you, you have fought a glow white. He's, he, he's in the way of books. <laughs> he's in the way of books. There's also a lot of friends. You conked him. Um, you could try using your quills. Check that out. Bottom right corner. Yeah. Look at that. So you basically, um, it's, it's exactly like it sounds. Like you're basically a giant porcupine right now. And you can just like shred your surrounding. Give it, a, give it another go. Now the only thing I will warn you about is every time you do that, you notice how you have less quills? That mm. that affects how much armor. Ooh, ooh, okay, hold on. You're you're taking quite a lot of damage. Time for an old gravity grenade. I'm gonna see how you handle this. Uh, get out of here! Get out of here! Everything. Get out of here! Everything. I'm gonna eat some bark. All right, that's always a good option. You are confused, but that's it has improved your fine. situation. Mm -hmm. That's a that's a pretty good. Uh, like you know that it'll hit them no matter what, like that. Your AVs is still at nine, so that's good. Um, 
I'm not sure if you're still under the effects of the Witchwood Bark, so you... Oh, I guess you're still confused, so it doesn't matter. Bum, 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 bum. One of them is dead. Okay, you are losing AV dramatically now. That's bad. So I might recommend, um, if you go southwest, there is space to move. And just put some distance between you and the glow white to give yourself a bit of breathing room and also time to recoup from the confusion. Just you going southwest. You, yeah, you're just hitting southwest. You, like you can. There you go. Perfect. Uh, now you can now? you can eat some more witchwood bark mm. to recover. What's in tonics? You know. You want to do a salve instead? I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, go for it. You only have the one, but it's fine. You'll get more of those. Nice thing about the salve is that uh, you you're guaranteed not to be confused. This is good. They're stunned. Looks like they're perma stunned. You can conk them again. <laughs> splat, 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 squish. They're wounded. They're stunned. They're still stunned. They're wounded. Remain stunned. Badly wounded. Almost dead. Very close. Done. Oh, well, they really liked that one, huh? Yeah, bears were happy that you put an end to that guy. And you have a, uh, let's see, a salt hopper mandible. That's how come they were doing so much damage to you. They had a pretty good longsword. Do I want it? Um, you are a cudgel. You can use it. But I actually spot a warhammer to your northeast there, which you could probably make use of. But um, aren't you you're using a nano pneumatic jackhammer? I don't know if the warhammer will be better. And certainly it won't be able to dig, so I assume you will not want it just yet. What about the sandals of the river wives? They don't offer AV. The move speed is nice, though. I won't lie. Yo, there's mechanical wings there. Yep. Those are those are worth taking, even though they're heavy. They're they're worth a, a pretty penny. All right. Yes. The two-handed steel warhammer is eight penetration. I am pretty sure that is better than your nano pneumatic, but not by much. I think the damage is comparable. Uh, do I want it? I don't know. You can compare. Let's have a look at your nano pneumatic. The nice thing about the nano pneumatic is it really makes situations like the one you're in a lot easier. Fine. Oh, I got tar on it. It's only pen seven and it is 2d4. So, um, did I say it was nine or eight? The, uh, the uh, eight, eight. So it's really not that much better. And if you want to continue digging through walls, it would mean like equipping and unequipping. So I'd probably give it a pass. I know um, my buddy Narf that works on Caves of Cud has a really decent mod for switching um, like sets of weapons. So something like that makes this really a lot easier so you can like switch between a set of weapons and like a nano pneumatic jackhammer. Daggers I want. Definitely want daggers. Sandals you said I could leave. You can, you, yeah, I mean, yeah. I always value AV over movement speed. Uh, let's leave the hammer. There's a lot of I feel of like I blew here. up a book, though. You could do, like, an auto-explorer and just, like, tab whenever it tells you about books. That's fine. I just think I, think I quilled a book to death. Oh. 
That's fine. There's tons of books. I assume I never don't want books. You always want books. Books are one of the best things to, that you can find. Oh my god, a Taco, Taco Suprema! Ooh, that's a really good find. Uh, I'll take it then. Take one. Is it just food? Yep. It... <laughs> so... Um... It is food and you can eat it, but th there is a, uh... Kind of an unintended purpose that Taco Suprema fulfills. Ooh, is that a painted shelf? It's certainly pink. You want to hit How do I... F1? Mm. It's ah. graffitied. Little attention has been substituted. A very big wuss when one comes by. <laughs> That's pretty good. I love a good graffitied object. That's a pretty good graffiti. It's actually quite legible. I want to I want to um, crowdfund a project, uh, make a make a like a note of all graffiti and caves of cud and then have make actual graffiti in real life of of it. I think that would be fun. Why is that goat fighting that mysterious man? They're not friends. They don't like each other. Ooh. Uh, I don't want to get the whole thing, right? I want to just... Collect liquid. Collect the liquid. Yeah. I didn't... I actually didn't know that hookahs had fresh water in them. You can't smoke it now, though. Probably. Mm, I'm gonna try. Oh, you did. There you go. It does nothing. <laughs> smoke the hookah, pet the pets. That's the way you spell success. That is how... You can't spell success without pets. I will not be taking questions at this time. A reason. <laughs> oh, Russia floor. Nice. And the shrine depicts a significant event from the life of the ancient sultan Russia in Tuber the gyre widened and the second triad of plagues afflicted the land. The legs of kith and kin kneeled to iron. Darkness bloomed from the earth in this hardum vardum black in the sky. Rishif walked below the chrome arches and healed the sick. Makes you think, you know? I mean, that is, uh, that is genuine cud lore right there. Alright. I think we're done here. There's more books. Tons more books. Yeah. Oh, a fust, a frust, a frustum. Oh, is really... that's actually quite spicy. What does that do so in there? So I should there? shoot it. Well, uh, why don't we look at it? You shot it. I, I don't it. think I hit it, though. No, you didn't. Yeah, it's tough. Um, that's a pretty spicy thing to find on the surface. I guess you could take it on, but I if it like gets straight to you, then you might want to hit the bricks. Pretty sure it will, because you're a very bad shot. <laughs> Oh, that was a nice hit. Okay. Yeah. Luckily, it's doing a very bad job of, like, approaching you. That was a good hit. Oh, you killed it. Nice. That wasn't so tough. Eh? You got some very lucky hits there, and, uh, yeah, no, that, that went well. When will you just appreciate my skill 
Yo, good that job. I have, no, I have no say over. <laughs> Congratulations on uh, rolling the dice well. Performing our lives, let's say. I don't know. Uh, performing our lives and struck from the wooden... Struck from the wooden bookshelf to the southeast. I think it was just called performing our lives. Oh. Oh, there's a chest there. I get the impression there's still stuff here. Yeah, you can break through that uh, fence. Oh, no, we checked that chest. That's where the taco was. Oh, right. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, th I think we found everything. My cud senses are tingling. I, I still think there was another stuff. hookah that we didn't look at specifically. I think there's a bunch of stuff here still. But I auto looked. Did it oh. say that there's nothing? Why is that man shooting me? Did you hit them by accident? I think he was trying to shoot the cannibal and he hit me by accident. Yeah, I think that's true. Let's go look at that hookah. Well, there's... okay. What? You, you hookahed. You 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 poo you poo poo food poo food the who could. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Like liquid. I mean, we Fixed. were uh, running low on water, so that's quite good. Those things are ten pounds. So you're saying I shouldn't have washed the dog? I get it. No, I'm not saying that at all. You've always been anti-dog in this game. <laughs> wow. I Where am I going? Believe I have, what? You, you're going west. We're leaving this place. We're trying to find some forgotten ruins. Hey, we Is found them. Is that where we are? We found oh. them, yeah. Just now. Right. Top right corner. Oh, doggy. No, doggy. Oh, no. They're, they're fighting the goat. The goat will for sure win. You pet the dog. Now he's inspired. Uh, to you, but... No, oh, I can't kill him. I mean, I know I can, but <laughs> I didn't save the dog. Returning malice with malice, it only makes the world worse, you know? Blood for blood. Well, there's your uh, there's your first slumberling. Um, that's terrifying. He's sleeping, though. He is sleeping. Uh, they tend to sleep. That's, uh, they, they live up to their namesake in that sense. So, um, now that we know where the Forgotten Ruins are, we can leave and then make a note of where in the Parasang it is, or we can just head straight west from here if you want. <laughs> Opted for drilling through the mountains. Wow, that is spicy. Um, that is an electric snail flail, or sorry, electric snail, just, a, just an electric snail. Now they have already hit you with their, their buzz. So they shouldn't be, they shouldn't have too much left in them. Like juice. What was that thing that was running away? That was a robot. I believe it was a turret tinkerer. Did you kill it? Yeah. And I butchered it apparently. Ah, so remember I when his, um, his hat? Yeah, you remember the snail hat? Yeah. You just you just made your own. We can wear it. Check that out. Freebie snail shell. I love that hat. Only minorly impairs vision. Okay. What are you currently wearing? A cool hat for cool guys. Let's don't don't besmirch the snail hat. The skull cap. I went with the skull cap. Yeah. So I mean, you could continue wearing that. That's fine. Um, it does have some good resistances, very minor resistances. Oh yeah, sorry, one <laughs> plus five cold resistance, um, which is nice. Uh. My my philosophy on this remains unchanged. I know you want me to put the shell on my head, but no, that's not very Bavath man. No, you can you can continue wearing a lasting skull cap. It really doesn't matter right now. 
What if I wear multiple mechanical wings? Uh, I think that's one of the few things you cannot wear multiple of. If you, I was going to say, you, if you said, you, what if you wore both hats? You can actually technically do that. I don't have to break through this wall. Oh, yeah. Breaking through the wall. What? Oh, the goat killed it. Okay. I was worried I killed that dog, but... You can't. I don't think you can do that by accident. Unless Sometimes so, dog... when you're just busting through walls. Lots of goats on this screen. Lots of bloody goats. Yo, no, there's no need for swears. All oh, these bloody goats. Oi. What's all this then? Lots of bloody ghost goats in it. I am British, so this is fine. Tuesday. I, I, I have British background, so it's fine. <laughs> Someone out there, like, everyone does. Uh, hence. My middle name is a Doctor Who character, so, like, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. All right. This is, uh, I do, I do love the, the drill tactics. They are working for me. Is this something that Batman would do, you think? I think if he could, and it was the best choice, he would. I don't know. Somehow it doesn't, I don't feel like it has very Batman vibes. Do you think you would have, like, a, a bat drill? This is, this is that episode where... He's gone back in time, and he has to be prehistoric Batman. <laughs> it's a the, real storyline, man. Is it actually? Man, the, mm -hmm. the, he also has to be like a pirate. But he like he forgets who he is, but he just keeps making himself a version of Batman every time. <laughs> so there's like a pirate Batman. Pirate man? Uh, well, no, he's still Batman. He has a different name, but I forget what it is. Is that like when uh, Bruce Wayne, as a kid, uh, had a pirate crash through his window when he was having a? Uh, well, no, he's you know... he's still he's still him. He's just being thrown back in time, and he doesn't remember. All he remembers essentially is that he needs to be some form of Batman. Some for so he remembers bats. He just doesn't remember like how. Hold on, I'm Googling it. How did you do that without pausing the stream? <laughs> what do you mean? The stream wasn't paused. Well, I can use other things to Google. Oh, I see. I'm Googling it. I mean, I can Google it too, I suppose. What is your favorite Batman? I don't understand. <laughs> What don't you understand? This is a very simple question. What is your favorite Batman? Um, the? Oh, you mean uh, with the Robert guy from no. the guy from Twilight? Uh, I'm sure he's great, but that movie was so boring that I never finished it. Pattison? Is it is it Rob Pattison? Rob, Robbie, little Robbie Pattison. Little Sparkle Bob, Bob Rob. All right, okay. So the comic was called The Return of Bruce Wayne. He gets thrown back in time. It was written by Grant Morrison, so you know it's going to be pretty okay. Uh, he that has, like, a prehistoric Batman. He does pirate Batman. He does, like, a Puritan Batman. What is a Puritan Batman? Like a... Like a pilgrim. <laughs> Well, like with a a buckle on his head, on his he on have, his cowl. He does have he does have a big hat, yeah. <laughs> the city's too too small for the both of us, pilgrim. Why am I just doing this for like up to seven? 
Uh, basically, yeah. I, I remember it's three to seven parasangs, so we have to go. We have to go three parasangs out before we even get to the range. And we're still in the mountains right now, so we haven't even reached the first parasang as that is like a candidate. We're still in the mountains. We day thirty-five, still mountains, no Jasper. Out of my way, walls. Get out of my way, jerk ass. <laughs> oh Oh my god. Full circle. I just remembered. That episode of The Simpsons, you know what theme Homer is singing incessantly? That man. Na 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 leader. <laughs> Fair enough. <sighs> You're fighting a lot of things that are generally not hostile, but are right now, including that honey skunk. Well, they're dead now. That honey skunk had an axe. Apparently they grind, did. Apparently, I, I feel like that was the hermits. Your health is uh, uh, spooking me a little bit. You're fine. Yeah, you just, just double commit. It's fine. Hey, there you go. Just make sure you uh, do that. Press that nice button that makes your I'm low health. I'm hungry. Make your make your small health the big health. I need to eat. You do need to eat. What kind of uh, mouth-watering meal do you want to make today? Let's find out. Mm. So I'll just let you know that almost every ingredient pairs well with uh, vine wafer sheaf. Let's do a vine wafer, wafer, vine wafer sheaf on a congealed blaze. All right. Wow. Well, well, well. Yeah, I gather some fixings from some congealed blades, some vine wafer sheaf, a nip of astral goat hair. There are a lot of goats about about. About and a about? pinch of dust. What kind of dust? Some. <laughs> Never I drink fresh water. There's a 25% toast an area for pyrokin pyrokinesis. I toast an area? Yeah, you toast it. Don't worry about it. Whenever I'm set on fire, I don't thirst for the next 12 hours. That's fun. And use pyrokinesis at level 1 or 2. 1 to 2. You already have pyrokinesis. It's enhanced by 2 to 3 levels. Pyrokinesis is quite good. Let's do it. Um, ah, this... but Batman, soggy hot borscht. Borscht. <laughs> you, uh, that, that does mean, however, that you no longer have quills, so you're going to want to re-equip your armor. Toast. toast now. You can toast. Uh, armor. H. There you go. Cool. <laughs> All right. Um. You want to see how toast works? It's kind of fun. Why, why is what's <laughs> that happening? I was gonna say, why are those things on fire? <laughs> oh, the corpses are on fire. It's because of your campfire, I think. Whoopsie. That's fine. I'm still going west, right? Why, skunk? Yeah, I don't know why the skunks are not cool with you right now. You did level up though, so that's kind of nice. And you're you're inspired again. Let's let's not use that right away. I don't I do not understand why everyone is kind of cheesed at you. Ugh. This is our first pair of saying that is is a, a candidate. Um why don't we end the episode actually while we continue searching for this village which was a meant to be a short quest has turned into a long quest. Join us next time where we do the thing. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Do that. I'm going to end the wow. episode. I'm not even going to do my outro. Don't do it. <laughs>